Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today's video was a fun idea that one of my best friends um, sent me actually. She was looking for a dress for a special occasion, but she didn't want something that she was only gonna wear for special occasions. She wanted something that would also work for work and work events, that sort of thing. So she thought that would be a fun idea for a video and I agree. So I thought what we would do is a little shop with me. I asked you all on Instagram where your favorite places were to buy special occasion dresses and I wanted to then see which ones I thought could also work for work and other, and other occasions and be as versatile a purchase as possible so you can get as many wares out of the item as possible. So based on what you all said on Instagram, there were two responses that were most popular. By far the most popular answer was Nordstrom. And then the second most popular answer was the Outnet. And so that's what we're gonna go with today. So we're gonna start with Nordstrom. I'm gonna show you the kind of filters that I would use and scroll through some pages and show you which ones I think would work well for work. So let's get started with Nordstrom. All right, so we'll start with some filters. I'm gonna click day to night, wedding guest, graduation, and work. And then for length, I'm gonna go with a knee length and a midi. So here are the results. To no one's surprise, there are a lot of black dresses. Some of these I think would be fine, though I don't think there's anything that makes them stand out as evening. I actually saw V from what we wore in that Reformation dress, which is cute. I like the floral and that can work well for some special occasions. I'm thinking more of like a summer wedding, a cocktail party, a tea party, that sort of thing. But it's not what I would typically choose as a um, sort of special occasion dress. So let's click on this dress right here. The fabric looks okay, maybe a little bit too casual. I don't dislike the draping in the front. I like the cap sleeve, but yeah, I don't love that one. Let's see what else there is. I kind of like the purple of this one. A wrap is always a classic option that can, because of the sort of draping of a wrap, look a little bit more luxurious. Though this one doesn't seem anything too special, though a faux wrap I do just appreciate in general more than a regular wrap. I love the cut of this dress, which I think would work well for a special occasion. It would be fine for work, but maybe the sort of satin kind of look to it is a little bit too formal looking for a typical workwear dress but I do really like the cut. I think that that's fun and luxurious and beautiful. All right, um, this one would be okay too. I think that the bateau neckline can lend itself to be fine for either occasion. The fluted sleeve is also kind of something added to it, but I think that that is going to fall out of favor fairly quickly, so it probably won't last as many years as I know I I prefer a special occasion and work dress to last. Hmm, the sleeves of this one are sort of interesting because the sheerness to the sleeve adds a little something. Oh, I of course love the burgundy. The sheerness adds a little something to it that makes it work for special occasion, but then the cut of that is so appropriate for work. So I do kind of like that one. I think that that could span both occasions pretty easily. We get to more florals and... Yeah, I'm not, I like the draping of this one, but I think that the floral print makes it a little too casual. I do, I do think that a draped neckline can look nice though. And then what else do we have here? The next page. Nothing is super popping out at me. This one, you know, I like the length of it. I like the the tie, but yeah, the flowers are just, they, that one is a particularly casual print. This one's pretty, this could work. I like the detail of this a lot. It actually reminds me a little bit of the fold and the things that they do with their dresses. I'm curious as I'm scrolling through these if 
anything sticks out to you all that is just not really sticking out to me. I mean, obviously the full length dresses, this one with the lace, those those definitely look more formal, but yeah, they're not really doing anything special to me. This is the same sort of thing with the sheerness, and I actually think that the floral on this is a little more sophisticated, can lend itself to a special occasion a little better. I like the high neckline of this one too. Actually, I do like that dress. I think that one would work pretty well. This has different patterns to it, but I don't really love any of them. The cut itself though kind of works and Leota dresses are super comfortable. I really like them for work. All right, this one is a good cut. I, I always think a trumpet skirt looks a little more formal, maybe because I tend to associate that cut with weddings a little bit more, but it would need a little something added to it to make it special enough for a special occasion. Yeah, the rest of these are just really evening. Yeah. Okay, let's go over to the outnet. So, well, wait a second. We can literally only pick dresses and then clothing size or color. That's not helpful in terms of filters. But I guess let's just go through the first few pages and see what they say. So, these are fine. <laughs> Nothing is jumping out to me personally. And well, I kind of like this Victoria Beckham dress. You obviously couldn't wear to a wedding, but some other kind of summer occasion, a graduation, that would work for that kind of special occasion. But it, the fabric is a little, a little more casual. I like some of these dresses fine. I just wouldn't necessarily choose them for either work or special occasions, and definitely not both. Oh, this one kind of works. Oh, never mind. <laughs> the cutout makes it not appropriate for work. If you wanted to wear a blazer over it all the time, then that one would work, I guess. So far though, I'm just not particularly impressed with anything on here. I feel like everything is really bodycon or a little bit more casual. Just not, you know, of course, because we can't filter through. So this is just all of the dresses. So it's gonna be hard to find some real winners here. Yeah, these are not, not doing it for me. I'm not feeling the out net particularly for this, for this little escapade at least. All right, let's try evening rather than dresses and see what comes up. So we're getting cocktail party attire. So at least we've got the special occasion down. Yeah, we saw some of these dresses before. I don't really see any that I'm loving for work. They're fine for special occasions, sure, but... Yeah, they're definitely more cocktail than even like wedding guest special occasion in my mind. I like the colors. I'm liking seeing more color. Oh, we just passed a jumpsuit. Jumpsuits are a good option. I think those can work really well for either occasion, but you have to find the right jumpsuit. This skirt is kind of pretty. Let's see. Yeah, neither of those are the right jumpsuit, but jumpsuits themselves are are nice. I think with a long kind of skirt like that, you can find a good pairing. Oh, this one could work. I like the long sleeve of this one. The cut of this is nice. I think though I think a wide leg is actually another cut that's really nice for either occasion. It just looks a little more sophisticated and luxurious and um, you know, it just moves really nicely. And I think that movement is nice in a special occasion piece. Let's see. Yeah, same sort of thing with this jumpsuit. It looks like it just has a nice cut. Oh, no. Okay, I don't like the fabric of that one very much. Yeah, I would say that there's nothing here that I'm, like, super loving. So, some things are fine, but... You know, I really think what I'm looking for are things that have a little 
extra something to them. And I know nobody asked for it, but maybe we should check out the fold because I think that might be a better website than these. So let's go there. All right, so here are the dresses from the fold. And the pattern ones I think are a little trickier, but the solid colored ones, I mean, to me, those are perfect for both special occasions and work. That neckline is really beautiful. It adds a little something. It's very elegant. It's sophisticated. It certainly works for work and for special occasions. The fabrics have some nice like weight to them. I think that the wool is okay. Wool is not necessarily the first fabric I would think of material for special occasion, but when it's draped so beautifully, it does kind of work. This is so pretty to me. Like That is such a beautifully wrapped wrap dress. And I like a sleeveless dress a lot of the time, though the neckline of this one is beautiful as well, and I really like the color. I think that one's really pretty. I don't always find that these can be worn by all body types super well, but there are so many options. And in general, just looking through all of these, these are exactly the kind of things that I think of when I think of something that can work so beautifully for both occasions, that can be versatile. That midi one, maybe a little less so, but in general, they're just beautiful. They're draped nicely. There's something extra about them and sophisticated, but they just work for both occasions, even the jumpsuit. Okay, so that was pretty interesting. I definitely think the fold, which wasn't even on anyone's radar really, is one of the better places to shop for these kinds of items, but really filters matter so much. I'm not gonna look through 14,000 dresses and I certainly am not gonna pick something just based on color and size. I definitely need more information than that. So the outnet is pretty much out for me, but I do think that Nordstrom, you can get some good items and then the fold, Really for me, I like the same silhouettes on my body, whether it's a special occasion dress or a work dress. Sometimes some people like to wear like a mini dress or something for special occasions. And if that's the case, if you wear something that has a nice top that you could potentially put another skirt over and make it more work appropriate, that that would be one way to, to reuse those items, get more use out of them. And then if this is something that's like white tie or even black tie and you want something all the way down to the floor, then it gets a little bit more tricky as well. But I think what makes something work for a special occasion is that it feels luxurious. And so that can happen in terms of the materials that we use if they feel a little bit more luxurious. And then also the cuts, were, are they interesting? Is there something about them that's unique? Does it look like it was time and labor intensive in order to make that item? That makes it feel a little bit more special. So I think items like the fold dresses work really well in that second aspect. And then finding something that looks a little more silky, a little more satiny works well for special occasions, but I would stick more with a silk, which I find to be much more appropriate for work in a more versatile fabric than something like a satin. So I do hope that that is helpful. Please let me know your thoughts down below and I will see you in a future video. Bye.